Hey guys, Blue Mouse here. I'm here to show you a strike that could save your life in the street. Not for you UFC guys. This is, it's not gonna work for you guys, but this will save your life in the street. I call it the C-Strike hook, okay? Now it's really two hooks put together, so I'm just calling it C-Strike hook instead of C-Strike hooks. Whew, that's, come, that's confusing. Okay, first thing you're doing, Guy gets in your face, you got nowhere to go. Your back's up against the wall, or you always try to take a step back and raise your hands up and open saying, I don't wanna fight, back the fuck off. That's what you do, if there's space, okay? I don't wanna fight, back the fuck off. Then if they come in, your hooks start flying, okay? But, say you got no room, some guy's in your face, you got about this much, this much space, distance, you can't go back anymore. He's in your face. I want you to protect yourself at all times. And do not use this unless it is a very dangerous life or death situation. That's the way you perceive it, okay? So the first thing you do, right up through the collarbone, you almost bounce off the collarbone and you hit the trachea with a web of your hand, just like this. Call it a C-strike because it's like this, okay? So hit that. As soon as I hit that, I got a short chopping hook coming in because I, I've, I've uh, thrown my hip into it, right? I've engaged my right hip, so now my left hook is, is ready to go. My left hip is cocked because I threw my, I threw my C-strike with my right. So now my left hip is cocked. Potential energy right there. Swing back with a short chopping uh, left hook to the chin. Okay, so you're here, guy's in your face, you don't have any time to talk to this guy or try to, you know, try to de-escalate it. It's, it's on, and you can see it in his face. So, C-strike to the throat, come back with a short chopping left hook to the chin, and as soon as you're unwound, you're wound all the way, you come straight back with a very, very tight Reverse hook. So you're here, boom, right back. Now your, your, your hip is all the way engaged. Now you want your right hip engaged. And while you're doing that, your left hip creates a torque. And you want that torque to give you power on the hammer fist right here. I call it a reverse hook because you're covering for a hook you just threw. And it might be that you missed the hook and the reverse hook did the knockout, okay? Either way, you're resetting with a power hook, okay? So you've thrown this left, left hook, you're a little bit in a precarious position, but you wanna, you wanna mitigate any type of damage and create more damage on them, so you throw a really short, tight reverse hook hitting with the, with the hammer fist, okay? So you're here, here. You can generate a lot of power with the, with the chopping hook, boom, and with the reverse hook, bing, okay? So it can be bing, bing. You can create power with both of those, all right? So, C-strike, short left hook, reverse hook, okay? Now you're, you're back in action. All right guys, thanks for coming. And I'm giving you these techniques because I want you to stay safe in the street. Yeah, I want you guys to win UFC titles if that's what you want. But my main, my main goal, or my main, I say the, the majority of what I'm teaching and the reason I'm teaching it is so you guys can stay safe in the street in these crazy times. And you gotta learn some basic techniques, very basic, and then practice them on a regular basis, so they become in your muscle memory. So when the adrenaline's pumping and you get attacked, some of these tech techniques will come through. I hope you like that, that uh, technique, the C-strike hook. Thanks for coming, stay safe, thanks.